time for Thursday Thoughts, where I tell you some thoughts I've been thinking on a Thursday. So a bunch of people in a town really want to play soccer, so they form a soccer team. And they, about two or three times a week during the summertime, they get together and they play soccer because they love playing soccer. And then they would uh, typically have some donuts afterward. At some point, someone just started bringing the donuts. Hey, cool, that's a fun thing to have after we've uh, burned off a bunch of calories, put on a bunch more calories, right? So they play the soccer and they play the game. They have so much fun and they have a little treat afterwards to kind of decompress, cool down, and socialize. But then as time goes on, people get more and more interested with the donuts. They get wild with the donuts. They start uh, experimenting with flavors of the donuts. And, and a committee is formed to make sure uh, to, to share the donut procuring responsibilities evenly. And then well, they decide, you know what, we, we should probably have a better spot to eat the donuts. So they rent out a building uh, to go eat the donuts in. They said, you know, we should probably have some coffee with the donuts. And so they get some coffee. And, but no, you know, we want a lot of options with our coffee. So another committee is formed to, to research and procure different varieties of coffee to eat with the donuts. And then they decide, you know, this place is kind of drab. We should get some decorations. So another committee is formed to get the decorations, to get the tables, to get all kinds of stuff. And you know what? TV would be nice. So they take up a collection to buy televisions, several televisions, because not everybody wants to watch the same thing. And they place them around the space so that when they're eating their coffee and eating their donuts and drinking their coffee, they can watch whatever they want, be it sitcoms, be it sports, be it old movies. <clears throat> and then one day, someone moves to town who's a soccer fan, and they see an ad for the Anytown USA Soccer Club. Great, I can go play some soccer. And they show up at the appointed time, ready to play some soccer, but they found that what they're actually doing here is eating donuts, drinking coffee. You see, they've become so concerned with this thing that grew up incidentally around the soccer that they only play the game a little bit. They're mostly concerned about the donuts. Sometimes I get really concerned that the church has become a soccer team that really just cares about donuts. We started as a group constituted by the incarnate God, a group that had the experience of the Holy Spirit and felt drawn to God and felt drawn to lead a different life, a life dedicated toward pursuit of that transcendent, eternal, yet very much imminent God and blessing the world in the way that Jesus has blessed it. You know, living differently, living selflessly, living uh, anti-materialistically, reaching out to the poor, to the, the, the least of these, and speaking truth to power and challenging those in power. And then you know, we, we'd meet anywhere. We'd meet at Bob's house. We'd meet at Jill's house. It didn't matter because... The mission was what we were here for. We were here for God, here for each other, here for living as Jesus lived and as Jesus taught us to live. And then at some point, someone decided, well, we should probably get a, a, a freestanding uh, building for us to meet in. And then somewhere along the line, they decided, though, it should be pretty. And then somewhere along the line, we decided that we should... Uh, we, that these traditions that evolved around worshiping God, uh, we should be ironclad in that. And it went on and on and on, and we developed more and more things, and we developed more and more systems. We developed more and more extra stuff around simply living as followers of Jesus Christ. That now, a bulk of what we do seems to not really be concerned too awful much with God. Most of our time and effort goes into maintaining our buildings, maintaining our traditions, just keeping all the rest of stuff going, and we don't really spend the time that we ought as a group praying, studying Scripture, and truly trying to form disciples of Jesus Christ who want to live differently 
in the world, who want to inject this world so full of Christ-likeness. But we uh, instead spend a lot of money building and keeping up beautiful structures like this one and structures of a, more, of a less uh, material nature, like denominational structures, church structures, those uh, ways of, ways of re, uh, relating that we build up. Friends, I truly worry about that kind of stuff, and the church should always be asking itself, are we still playing soccer, or are we just eating donuts and drinking coffee? Let's pray. Gracious God, help us to see clearly. Help us to be committed to you and what you want, and not to the things we have built up around you. In Christ's holy name we pray. Amen. Thanks for watching, folks. If you found this beneficial, share it with your friends. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. And be kind.